Hey there folks, Zach Smith, the pest dude here, also coming from Smith's Pest Management, your Bay Area's pest control experts. We take care of pests for our customers, but we have questions coming from around the country and around the world. What do I do if I can't hire you? What do I do if I want to save money and do it myself? Today we're talking about ticks, ticks around the home, ticks on your pets, ticks on your body. So here's a few products that I recommend having if you're going to take care of your own ticks. Now, if you're going to take care of ticks in the yard, uh, they're going to live in the grasses and the shrubs. They're coming in on wildlife. They're dropping off, off of wildlife into your yard for eggs or in stars, little young baby ones as they go through their life cycle. And you can spray something like temperate fx now follow the label follow the instructions and wear your protective equipment but if you put this in a backpack sprayer and you spray the areas around your yard that harbor ticks this will go a long way to keeping the tick population under control on your property now if you're going out and about hiking or uh, just you have ticks that are getting on you um, here's a great product it's a permethrin uh, personal tick repellent spray C controls other bugs as well again read the label know what you're putting on your body permethrin is a synthetic pyrethrin you want to know what you're doing it's labeled for human use it's good for repelling ticks P be sure you know what you're doing though this is not a natural botanical product by any means but highly effective so you got to make your decisions here um, if you want something natural and uh, botanical for around the yard, here's a ready-to-use hose and uh, spray application. And this is Wonderside Flea and Tick for the yard and garden. Uh, easy label, uh, pretty low, low toxicity as far as the ingredients goes. You can use it around your kids, the garden, all that. Read your label, understand your protective equipment, but know that this is something that's going to knock ticks down in a much more natural way. Another product that I love to add to this list, but I don't have it with me today, it's back at the shop, is our Ecovia MT. MT stands for Mosquito and Tick. It's a natural botanical product. It's an insecticide that's going to be sprayed around the yard. Um, it's designed from botanical biodegradable ingredients. So it's got an immediate knockdown, but it doesn't last a long time. And that can be really good for folks who are chemical conscious. So Ecovia MT is another one to add to our list today for good control of uh, ticks around the yard. All right, now for the pets. We have PetCore 2. This is a wonderful product for fleas and ticks. Um, you're gonna wanna read the label again. Always read your labels. This is, this is serious stuff, folks. These products are deemed safe and appropriate for use on you and, and around your family, but you need to know what you're applying. This is not just non-toxic. Hey, it's safe, you can put it anywhere. Pay attention to your labels, but this is a product that we really recommend for your pets. All right, and then we have a big old box here. If I can pick it up with one hand, there we go. All right, tick tubes. All right, so these are really kind of a fun, fascinating way of controlling ticks. These little tubes are full of cotton. Now, why would you put cotton in a tube around the yard? Well, mice are a major source of the life cycle change or harborage for ticks. So when you put these tick tubes out, the natural rodents in your environment will gather up that um, cotton in those tubes. Now that cotton's been treated with a powdered uh, tick pre preventative product, um, a pesticide. So the mice take it back to their nest and build a nest with it and they become tick proof. A huge source of ticks is in your small rodent population on your property. So if you can control the ticks on them, then you interrupt that life cycle and you don't end up with adult ticks. So ticks go through many, many uh, instars from a teeny little baby tick to a medium to a larger, larger to adult. And each time they actually go through that transition, this incomplete metamorphosis, they drop off their host. So they latch onto a host and they feed and they get bigger and they drop off and they molt and they go find another host. If you can interrupt them at the rodent size, a small, small size, that's a great place to do it, and this is a passive way. So, listen, there's a lot of other products out there that are uh, labeled for ticks around the yard. These are some that I like to use, and you can trust Smith's, and you can trust the pest dude to be doing research for you and look for products that are going to help you out and save you money. And, it, and if you do have to hire a pest control pro, you'll have learned now tricks of the trade. So when you're asking questions, you'll have smart questions, and you won't uh, have to worry about getting taken advantage of. So... Thanks for checking out PestDude.com. I'm Zach Smith, and have a great day, folks.